Hello there, namaste. So this is 12th fail. I, I was recommended this because it seems like uh, it's more like a... I, I believe it, it's more like a slice of life down to earth, not overly action-packed, not overly uh, documentary type where it's a reenacting of uh, tragic historical events or historical events. It's more just like a, a slice of life, a story of uh, a person like in school and supposed to be more like inspirational and something like that. So yeah, yeah, um, 12th fail. And there are no subtitles. So I'm guessing that's, was that 200,000 or 2 million? Something, uh, it was a big number. I didn't count the zeros. Fail, I guess. IS, IPS. Oh, that, that's what bothered me. Yeah, it's it's two hundred thousand, but I think that's larks, right? Because there is a the the comma on um in, in in when it comes to numbers in in English, the comma is after every three, every three. Yeah, that's what that's what's throwing me. Zero. Pardon me. ये जो भाइन के नाम तू मांग रहा है ना, ये घूस है. They had me sold with three idiots right there. <laughs> but I, I think this one's supposed to be more down to earth. I know that actor. Don't I know that actor? He looks familiar. But I don't want to uh, uh, place it. I, I need to see his thumb. I need to see his thumb. <laughs> For those of you who know who I'm uh, thinking about. No, no, it's not him. 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 ये नीचे नहीं झुकते हार नहीं मानते सर बड़ा पक्का होता है इनका ये जज्बा और तुम देखना यही जज्बा एक दिन तेश बदलेगा फेल फेल या आई एम नॉट गोना लाई इट डज लुक लाइक हिम ऑलमोस्ट Almost. He's much skinnier. His skin tone's a little darker, I think, but it, it almost looks like him. It's like his ears are almost the same. And then it turns out to be him just just when he was younger. But uh, Lak Lakshi? Laksha? Laksha? It, it, it almost looks like the actor. That's not him. Oh, okay, so he's doing it all again. He's failed. So that's what this is about. He's failed multiple times. He's run multiple jobs just trying to uh, progress his future, just to have a better future than his, his parents. It, uh, that's what it is. That's what it is. I mean... Here, here in the U.S., you deal with a lot of people who talk about how they were privileged because of the, their skin color. But I've grown up. I've seen it. My parents struggled just because, well, just because they both weren't white. But <laughs> but it's like uh, my, my grandpa, not my grandpa, but it was my aunt's grandpa. He, him and his wife struggled to give my aunt uh, a, a great upbringing. My aunt and uh, my uncle struggled to give my cousins an even better upbringing. However, my cousin interpreted it as she's white, 
so she was born with privilege. <laughs> It, it, it's a mindset. It, it's one of those things that it's hard to see what other people have to sacrifice for yourself or for you because you just want to assume that you were just gifted it because you're superior. And that's a very bad mindset to have because you're refusing to acknowledge the people around you, let alone everyone around uh, everywhere. So he is struggling and constantly repeating. So uh, 12th fail. 12th fail. He goes 12 times, 12 times to be uh, to get a degree, to become more successful, to have a better future. Okay, okay. That's why it's an inspirational film because he's he keeps going at it, keeps going back, working so hard to pay for the 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 uh, for the education. Restart. Restart. Yep, it took me the very end to realize what this trailer was about. It took me the very end, but there's nothing wrong with that. I, I so I can see how this is inspirational. It, it's someone who feels like everything is against them. Just get up and keep keep struggling, keep struggling. Just just restart. Restart like the the song was or as it was screaming restart 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 you just you just got to You've got to continue you can't you can't let other people I had this conversation recently where I was talking to uh, uh, You you can't let other people dictate you can't live in your own head You have to act upon things sometimes you have to just do and you can think back and think like, oh, okay, I probably made the mistake right there. I probably shouldn't have done that. But you can't live your life constantly uh, thinking upon things that you have no control over. What you do have control over is having the ability to, to do. Like here, he had the ability to go back and try again. He fails. Has the ability to go back, try again, he fails. Has the ability to go back, try again, he fails. Has the ability to go back, try again, he fails. And it's like one of those things. You need to just commit yourself to something. And I, I, I like that just because a lot of people don't, don't commit to things. They, they do things half-heartedly or they'll constantly be thinking and planning out their entire lives on a spreadsheet going like, I have to do this at this point in time. And then I have to do this at this point in time. And I have to do this at this point in time. The problem when you think like that is like when one thing gets messed up, you realize your whole life is not going to work out the way you wanted it to. No, it, it, there's nothing wrong with planning out your life. But there are times when you just got to act upon things. I've been a part of organizations and uh, worked in places where they'd all the leaders would get together and talk about what their plans for the future was were. You know what ever happened? No one ever did anything. You can talk about what you want your future to be, but if no one acts upon it, if no one tries and tries and actively tries again, then guess what? Nothing's going to change. If he didn't continue to fail and continue to try again, he would have never succeeded. And I'm guessing that's where the story heads. It's like, he better end with a success because it's going to be depressing. I talk it all up. I watch the film and I'm like, he lost. He lost. <laughs> yeah, but okay, that, that's, that is motivational right there. That is motivational. I, I enjoyed that. I enjoyed that for sure. Oh, sorry. Sorry. I talk quite a bit every now and then, especially as I realized what it was about. Yeah. A powerful film, powerful film. I didn't get to see the subtitles. There were no subtitles in the one I found. Nothing wrong with that. I got the gist of it at the end of the film, at the end of the film. I'm sorry. I spent so much time trying to, I was like, why does he look familiar? Why does he look like that other actor? He's not, he doesn't have uh, the, the dual thumb. I mean, is he like a sibling, a cousin, a distant? I know, I know, sadly, nepotism is, is uh, in the media industry. No matter where you are in the world, nepotism is a thing. So probably he's related in some aspect. <laughs> oh, I liked it. I liked it. I'll need, to, I'll, I'll need to try and find this and check it out. Thank you all for watching. Talk to you next time. Doodles.